In this video then, we're gonna be looking at the DC fan motors on the indoor PCBs and the outdoor PCBs. If you have a fan motor fault on either or, uh, there's two simple checks we can do to determine whether it's the fan motor, whether it's the PCB, or whether both has failed. First of all, if you could unplug the fan motor from the PCB, then with your meter set to DC, go across the first pin and the pin after the gap. The reason there's a gap is because it's 300 volts DC. So you should be getting 300 volts DC off the board across pin one and four. Next to pin four is your feedback circuit. So that is just a 15 volt DC. So across pin four and five, you should have a 15 volt DC. If you have the 300 but not the 15 or have the 15 but not the 300, your PCB has failed. If you then want to check that it's the fan motor, Basically, with your meter set to mega ohms reading, we can go across the red and the black terminals, and you should have a mega ohm reading. Then we can go across the white and black, and you should have a kilo ohm reading. If either of these aren't correct, you know that the fan motor has failed and has taken the PCB with it. Okay, so if we have a fan motor error on the outdoor unit, uh, two checks to see if it's the fan motor, the PCB, or both. Fan motor connection, plugs in on the PCB. If we unplug the fan motor connections, you see on the plug, there's a gap between two of the colors. There's also a gap on the pins. So across one and four, you should have a 300 volt plus DC coming off the board. And then four and five, you should have a feedback 15 volt DC. So if either of the voltages aren't correct or aren't present, then the PCB has failed. Resistance check wise as well for the fan motor, you simply go across red and black and you should have a mega ohm reading. And then across black and white, you should have a kilo ohm reading. If this isn't correct, the fan motors fail. If the voltage isn't correct, the PCB has failed. Generally, if one's gone, the other has as well. And that's all you need to know about the DC voltage, fan motor, PCB checks. <laughs>